Good morning, YouTube averts. John Stanek from Johnny Radio here, bringing you day 22 of the Great 28 album openers of all time. And this is going to be no exception, guys. Uh, I hope you've liked it so far. Uh, I can't believe we've only got one week left in this series. It's it's gone by so quickly, but it's been a blast. And uh, yeah, I, I think you can't go wrong with this track. It starts with an S, and it is. So What by Miles Davis off of his 1959 classic, Kind of Blue. Uh, you know, whether you're into jazz or not, uh, I think this is a perfect entry point. It was my entry point into jazz. You know, I've heard things here and there, of course, but uh, as far as an album to just sit down and listen to and meditate on. This was my first, and I'm so glad that it was, because So What hooked me from that opening bass line by Bill Evans that, that is so cool, that do 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 and then everyone else comes in, and then, man, when those drums hit and the, the trumpet by Miles comes in, it's just glorious, and my God, man, it was just like a who's who uh, a gathering of these guys in New York John Coltrane plays on this record, for God's sakes. I mean, you can't get any better than that. I mean, uh, to me, it's like Miles and Coltrane uh, were just the best of the genre of all time. So uh, for all those reasons, this record is a masterpiece. Uh, I think it's a 10 out of 10, just perfect album. You can put it on at any time and just uh, enjoy it, whether it's in the background, the foreground. But uh, say so what? Sorry, I was going to say, say what, like my series. Uh, but So What, I think, is just the ultimate jazz opener. It just hooks you from the get-go, and it's got a little bit of everything. You know, it's got some uh, a little bit of piano sol solo, a little bit of, uh, of Coltrane sh showing off his chops, Miles, of course. And uh, it's just, it's the epitome of cool. And uh, yeah, I mean, as far as jazz albums go. I, I feel I'm still somewhat new to the genre myself. I have a lot more exploring to, to go, but uh, if, if you're new to jazz, uh, this is the way to start and get into it and uh, keep going from there because, uh, gosh, I've gotten into so many different artists at this point. Uh, you know, Freddie Hubbard and uh, just, of course, Herbie Hancock, so many greats, but Miles... Um, was just uh, miles ahead of everyone at this point. No pun intended that he even named an album that himself. So guys, let me know in the comments below what you think of this pick. Would it have been on your list? Would it not? And uh, what do you think's coming next? We only got uh, six more days to go of the series. Uh, I kind of hate that it's coming to a close, but I promise we've got some more cool stuff for you in March. Uh, I'll be making an announcement on that in the near future. But guys, thank you so much for watching. We got top fives every Friday, album reviews, so much more. Thank you, and as always, Viva La Vinyl. So guys, thanks so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and be sure to ring the bell for notifications so you can always see great quality content like you're seeing on the screen right now. Thank you so much for supporting Johnny Radio, and I'll see you soon.